This week, we highlight another life well lived. 1967 was the first year teams with black players were allowed to compete in the Georgia High School State Basketball Tournament with white teams. Savannah's Alfred Eli Beach High School made history by winning it all that year with the help of a star named Larry Rivers. Rivers, who was born and raised in segregated Savannah, was a sophomore on that trailblazing team and went on to be an all-state player. After a successful college career, he was offered a tryout with the famed Harlem Globetrotters, a team that traveled the world, putting on its one-of-a-kind basketball show. Rivers, who was nicknamed Gator, dazzled Globetrotter stars like Curly Neal and Meadowlark Lemon with his ball handling and earned a spot on the team. He spent 16 years with the Globetrotters, rising to become a player coach and inviting the first women to the team in the mid-1980s. There you go, ladies. Give them a hand. After his run with the Globetrotters, Rivers became a high school coach and a pillar of the Savannah community, volunteering throughout the city and opening the Gator Ball Academy for basketball. In 2020, he was elected to the Chatham County Board of Commissioners. Larry Gator Rivers, a groundbreaking wizard with a basketball in his hands, died late last month in Savannah and was laid to rest there this week. He was 73 years old. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.